Hi, my name is Kaylee Four, and today I'll be talking a bit about an intervention development project that my team and I have been working on. So despite extensive work supporting the role of genetics in predicting eating behavior, environmental and behavioral factors like caloric intake and food cues in the environment are more widely understood and endorsed by the general public. However, genetic causal beliefs for weight have been linked to reduced bias and stigma toward people with higher weight, while environmental explanations seem to have the opposite effect. What is less understood is how explanations which endorse both of these causal factors together might affect bias-related outcomes. Further, immersive technologies that allow individuals to experience realistic scenarios as if they were a member of a stigmatized group have been shown to increase empathy, a term which in this context refers to someone's ability to understand and share in the feelings of another person. And we believe that this may be another key factor to consider for bias mitigation strategies. Given this understanding, we designed the present study to aid in the development of an educational intervention to reduce weight-based biases by teaching genetic and environmental concepts related to eating behavior. This was a fully online study which presented the educational materials and experiential scenarios that we designed to test their effectiveness at reducing weight-based biases. We also considered the mediating role of several factors, including empathy. Overall, we found that the educational video was associated with increased empathy, but greater empathy did not appear to reduce biased attitudes toward people with higher weight. So these results diverge from previous literature, which suggests that being embodied as a member of a stigmatized group might reduce stigma by increasing empathy. So as such, we believe that our intervention can be improved by adapting it to a more immersive modality, such as virtual reality, to further heighten empathetic concern and as a result, achieve the reduction in weight bias that we're aiming for. We believe that our development of this intervention exemplifies the expansive applicability of immersive technology in medical contexts.